Hello everybody, I'm Dan Hampton Hamer Game Channel and welcome back to the Adventures of Kaiser Wilhelm to the finale because I've given up trying to play as Texas. I do apologise that there has been a big delay in this episode coming out. However, I ran into a slight problem. My flipping recording file got corrupted. So yes, this is this is another another run. I'm, I'm having so much fun recording this stuff. That's why I took a break, it really annoyed me. Uh, plus work was kind of... Work came first and so did life, so sadly, uh, I'm only getting back to recording this now, on Wednesday. So yeah, let's let's actually get into this and play the Ottoman Empire. So, I'm going to point out like I did the last two attempts of recording this, I am not going to be finishing this tree. I am not going to be finishing it. The new Ottoman Reich is what I'm thinking that changes to. I am not going to be completing our focus, and I'm not going to complete a firmer loyalty because I do not want to become a puppet of the German Empire. I'll happily get the Kaiser on the throne, but I'm not becoming a puppet. I want to war my st way through uh, Africa and into the Middle East. Well, take over the rest of the Middle East, that is, and even into the Caucasus, hopefully. And maybe even to India. We'll see what happens. But anyways, let's get a going. Got to love starting out having to research infantry equipment one and a whopping nine factories. Oh. Oh, we are being spoiled today. Ah, perfect and economic depression. Mwah. Fantastic. On the plus side, if we look at our focus tree, we get rid of that by doing six 35-day focuses. So it's not the end of the world. In fact, I'm just going to get cracking on and sorting that out straight away. Afghanistan is requesting weapons to fight the Dominion of India. I, well, Dominion of Delhi, rather. Um, I'm sorry. I don't really have 3k guns to give away, so bye bye you can deal with that yourself. Could could this be potentially a second Russian civil war on our hands with the PLSR being uh, voted in? The syndicalists? Potentially. It depends who takes the reins, I think. Italy has been, well, I mean, socialist Italy is no more. The Italian confederation is here. Giovanni Messi has taken over. So I think we're going to get a peaceful reunification of Italy. I do like to see it. And Tom Mann's here because who doesn't love to see him with his Harry Potter-esque glasses on? Well, that's good. That's very good indeed. Georgia has turned their back on Germany. Well, Stalin, I think I'll be coming and paying you a visit once I've dealt with my, uh, well, my main rival right now, Egypt. And, of course, Iran, who hopefully doesn't end up joining the Russian faction out of thin air, because that can happen. The budget has been balanced, and the economy is now fully recovered. Happy days. That was very easy to sort that out. I guess we'll go ahead and start dealing with the army, because I want to get some military factories, which we get, what, three from the tree, and the production cost goes down on the infantry equipment. I'll happily take that over one factory. Why wouldn't you take this one? Why wouldn't you? Why is the Alash Republic trying to set up a... Well, establish economic ties with us when they're getting absolutely destroyed by the Russians. I I think we can cope on our own. Yeah, we're going to refuse that. Sorry. Ah, perfect. An opportunity has arisen. Demand Western Thrace. Ah, yes, very wise. They have given me the land I desire. Perfect. Well, we can leave that front uh, for the time being. And we'll uh, set up on my defensive line. Why? Why would I give you land? We refuse. Um. I, I don't know how I feel about that. Um. I, I don't think you were supposed to declare war on me like that, Iran. If I'm being totally honest, I, I don't think that's how things were supposed to play out. Well, Iran, I don't think it's going your mate way, mate, at all. Yes, let's approve women's rights. Yeah, this is, this is really not going their way. <laughs> Um, just kind of walking through territory at this point. Well, Armenia's dead. Happy days. I'll just outright annex them. It's giving me a nice border with Georgia and Azerbaijan, so... Could maybe even try and kill them. Ah, can he justify the new? Probably need 75% world tension. Can he complain how well this war's went? We're just butchering them now. I think the majority of their army's stuck over in Tabriz, so... I am a very happy geezer. Are, are you feeling okay? Khrushchev's here. What a terrible decision. Terrible. And Lev Grishin's here as well. Well, I suppose that's an interesting combo here. Will they join a faction together or will Ukraine still get destroyed? And there we go. Iran is no more. 
Ah, Italy's unified as one. Victor Emmanuel III's on the throne and uh, Greece also joined the Austrian faction. Because Bulgaria lost uh, very, very quickly. I've never seen Henry J. Kaiser before. Loving the surname. I I've, I don't think I've ever seen you though. I, I don't like your hairstyle, I'll have to say. It's, it's quite quite disappointing. Industrializer. Eh, some nice wee bonuses there. Some other not so nice. Japan is supplying them a decent bit of equipment. Well, the uh, Russian Socialist Republics here, Maria Spiridonova. Well, there goes my plan to take over the Caucasus. Oh well. Uh, to be fair, I could always backstab the Germans as Kaiser Wilhelm II, which would be quite hilarious and cursed. I'm literally better off losing that. Look what I get if I lose. That makes zero sense. What the hell is that? Oh no, Idris has returned to the throne. We will bide our time. Seriously? Seriously? We we shouldn't have got that event. We underestimated the resilience of the Ottomans. That's not ours. I'm going to give myself 150 PP back and 50 stability. I don't care about the manpower, but I'm giving those two things back to myself. What a load of rubbish. Wow, Ching fell very, very quickly. Very quickly indeed. There's kind of three giants spawning here. The Fenchian government... The Yang Zhao federal government and the Yunnan clique, whoever wins that war is probably going to be Ching's, uh, not Ching's, Feng Shan's uh, biggest rival. Congratulations Italy, you've killed yourselves. Well actually, maybe no. It's, it's going to be a tough one for them. If Hungary revolts right now it might actually be in their favour. I suppose Serbia's fighting Ilaria, which I guess is keeping them kind of preoccupied. Not the whole faction, but uh, at least it's keeping them preoccupied. Well, 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 the moment has come. I'm not conceding Sinai to Egypt. To war we go. And I'm just going to let them walk on in. Aid from Germany. Perfect. God, take my territory. Oh, yes, Germany offers us aid. Welcome. Welcome. Ah, finally. I've had to lose a little bit more land than what I was holding, which I'm a little bit dif disappointed with. But, uh, and I've had to call Persian, but finally we've got German officers demand to take charge and they shall have what they wish. Yes, grow more powerful. Do it. Armed putsch. Or putsch. What is happening? The palace raid? Ahmed? Oh no, well, goodbye to Abdul Mased II, if I pronounce that correctly. Hello to Ahmed IV. And Osman Fowl rides out. Oh, okay. Osman crosses the Golden Horn, cool. Osman captures the Sublime Porte. Osman executes the rebels. My god, he's... Oh, okay, uh, firing squad. And Osman's now the bloody Sultan Blinkenek. And who cares though, because Wilhelm's going to be on the throne soon anyways, so... That, that, that fighting was completely pointless. Oh, and there we go, the German military mission has fully taken control. Perfect, let's just finish this little focus, and then we can start... Oh, the Alzass ultimatum. We can start going down... Oh, there we go, second Velcro's kicked off. We can start going down our part of the tree, though. So we're not too far away from getting the Kaiser now. Well, that that's went pretty successful. Uh, Port Said isn't going anywhere anytime, but soon, but... Uh, Cairo's fallen. That's all I care about at this point. Oh, it's all green over here. Do you know what? Go for it. Go for it, men. I have complete faith in you. The reformed government of China? You're with Japan. Yang Yuting. The national legitimacy. Oh, that's not great, but... Hi, reformed China! And then Yang Zhao's pretty thick and so's Tibet actually. Tibet's a pretty chonky boy. Yeah, this this is this is going so up oh, they're dead. Well nice. Uh thanks thanks for joining us Egypt. Uh, we'll just mop up the uh, the stragglers now. There goes Syria. Welcome to the fold again. You should never Oh Transum Transum -er. Oh that may actually come in clutch for the Reich's Pact. You don't really have a lot of divisions but uh Maria is not in a great position. Brilliant. Thanks for that, Horthy. You've now put the Germans at war with the, the Austrians. That's 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 what's going to happen in a second. It's it's not happened just yet, but um, it's about to. They they, they are in the Reichspact, so yeah, fa fantastic. 
Oh, the Canadians are so smart. Let's declare war on the CSA. What a great idea that was. Who the hell are you? Harold Sterling Vanderbilt. Elite family ties. Are you going monarchist? Japan is now at war with Germany. Germany's not doing so well. They're not at war with the Austrians, thankfully. Their allies are. Or at least some of them are. Right, I annexed Jabal Shammer uh, just because I could. And uh, just because I wanted this to look nice. I'm happy with Persia sticking around. Like so. But uh, I really wanted to look like this. I look hella, hella thick and just beautiful. Really? Uh, I wish I could demand the Suez Canal. That would be... Uh, that would be fantastic. Hello, Stalin, it is I, the Ottoman Empire. I'm coming for that juicy frickin' oil. Wow, Stalin, you really didn't bother putting up much of a fight, did you? Perfect, we got rid of the Turkish descent. That is fantastic. Oh, look, I joined the Reich's Pact. Silence the Sultan. I feel like that Sultan's already been silenced. That's the thing. Osman's the one in charge. We are now officially in the... The Reich's Pact. We're the only... I'll join me, tell Europa why not. I'm the only part of the Reich's Pact that actually controls any Africa now. I welcome better relations with your Kingdom of Greece. We can be friends, even though I control some of your territory, but never mind that. Ah yes, we're the Osmanisches Reich. I've butchered that, but yes, we are... We're, uh, we're, we're now the Ottoman Reich. That's what I'm guessing that uh, translates to. We're invited the Kaiser as we speak to take the throne. Uh, how does that work? Austria was... Austria... Hey, you're known a faction. The Greece peace out with Bulgaria. Right, uh, Austria's just joined in as well. I, I don't see how that's working out, but uh, yeah, time to invade Ukraine. Oh, he's here. Wilhelm II is in charge. It is a beautiful sight. Come on, Sevastopol needs the fall. Perfect, you've made it across. Oh wow, you guys landed fantastically well. Slap that bad boy down. Slap that. Nice, Romania's fallen. It's left a wee pocket of uh, Ukrainian divisions. As I mentioned at the start of the video, I'm not doing a firmer loyalty, and I'm not doing that. Although they're very nice uh, focuses to grab, I, uh, I'm not doing it. I'm going to go ahead and now deal with uh, Egypt. Just get them, uh, well, get rid of that economic depression or turmoil, whatever it is, 20% consumer goods. Don't need that in my life right now. Oh, and they're dead. Oh, fantastic. Oh, nice, I got to take Crimea. Hell yeah. It's just a shame I don't control the rest of the Caucasus because that would have looked quite nice. But hey-ho, it is what it is. Eh, uh, why does it no... Why does it look like there's literally no Russian divisions? I don't really want to join against Japan, I have to say. So I'm, I'm just going to justify in Russia myself. I'll be in in 30 days. Hopefully these guys will be out as well by then. Oh, they've managed to arrive to the front line. Oh, okay. I'm hoping. I'm hoping we can do some damage here. I'm coming in to save the day. Ah, already off to a fantastic start. That's a nice wee encirclement we've got there. That's, that's all you got to do with Russia on this mod. It's literally just walking behind them. Find a gap and exploit it like there's no tomorrow. I'm putting my life on the line here, Germany. I hope you're going to repay the favour. Oh, Italy actually won against Austria. That's hilarious. Austria looks terrible now. Ploy the trucks. Oh, I'm sure actually someone commented recently saying that there's an easier way to do the supply thing, but I'm an idiot and didn't remember to uh, check what that button was, so yeah. No! Wilhelm the second's dead. Now we've got his boring ass son in charge. Boo. I suppose it's not a terrible portrait. You do have August von Mackensen's fancy hat, so at least that's something. I completely forgot that Russia actually has a border with Persia. I'm not bo I'm just gonna let them just sit there like a bunch of AI. AI. What what are you doing? Brilliant. Italy against the Aut uh, the Austrians. The Ottomans. The Austrians. Round two. Well, at least Canada didn't summon and secured Murmansk. I'll happily take that. How many Russians have we killed? Oh my days, 742,000. I don't know what's happened, but everyone's got tiny armies. 62 divisions. Like, I've I've actually got more than Germany. I've got more than France. I've definitely got more than Union of Britain. What has gone on? I'm sorry. You want Libya back? 
That is the most pathetic deal. 2,000 guns and a non-aggression pact. Oh, they must be joking, right? They must be. They must be joking. Surely. Surely. Italy, thinking they could pay me off with 2,000 guns. Mate, I've got 113,000 spare. Italians have threatened us with war. Oh, you can suck my wally, honestly. Oh, they declare war on me. Oh, wow. Wow. I bet you think you're f***ing hard, don't you? You'll never guess what I've just done. We're a little short of some equipment, but we're up to 43 combat with divisions. So I think it's safe to say that I'm going to slaughter the pishy little French and Junior Britannians that exist. Like this 1 to 10 division. Or 2 to 11. Oh! Yes, supply me with all that Gucci gear. Well, this is an interesting, eh, uh, Dunkirk. Eh, uh, very interesting indeed. How are we doing? Uh, Italy's no naval invaders just yet. That's nice. Why, why are the Czechs destroying us? 85 days, Germany. Are you calling me into that? I didn't really want to be at war with Japan. Come on. I really want to slaughter these. The Union of Britain actually has somewhat decent... The collapse of the Reichspact? No. Where come the exiled government? Uh, I. Have I just become super Germany? Oh what? I've I've been called at the war. Oh what? Are you actually serious? Oh Germany, you useless buggers, man. Oh well, uh, I I guess I'll just sit on the Italian border now and just. Uh, I guess just kill them. Ah, oh, all that fighting. All that fighting. All the blood that we lost fighting the Russians. And you go and collapse faster than that? German requests Ottoman support. Oh my god, that's hilarious. The Sultan shall aid the Reich. I don't know what that does. Oh, that could be quite good. The Pacific States won. Oh, they actually have uh, lower California as well. Mexico's getting gobbled by Canada, so hopefully you join the Entente uh, via means of asking for New England. Uh, France managed to take Ireland. Nice. Uh, there's still a chance. I just need to get rid of the bloody Italians and the Czechs, and then I'll be uh, free to give uh, the Third International a good pounding. I didn't realise we had broken through in the south. I didn't leave enough divisions to... Actually push that though. I wasn't expecting the breakthrough. We are we are taking heavy casualties. Didn't get me wrong, but stuff it. Oh hi. Am I gonna be able to just go like a glove? <laughs> right, right through the middle, right into Rome. Love it. The Italians are losing. Nah, nah. I don't care. You can kiss my backside now, Italy. Right, Italy. I would very happily have you completely die now. At this point, I. I've had enough of your sheer existence. Ah, thank you for dying, Italy. My days. You survived for far too long for my liking. Considering my main threat to deal with is the international, but uh, I suppose it's okay. Guess one of the good things currently happening is the fact that the Eastern Siberian Federation is still at war with Russia, and Russia has zero divisions, so I, I guess the international will be busy sending troops that way. Ah, yes. Victory. So we're not taking Saxony. We're not taking it. If we take Saxony, then we get the return of the German Empire and they literally just control Saxony. And then we become a puppet of them. So that's not happening. What I'd actually completely forgot in the show is that we actually do have the exile little focus trees because the German Empire chose to come to us. Um, we could do it to slay the sun, but uh, lessons of Pacific War. Oh, oh, I am so, I am so tempted to put Japan in their place. Sorry, Greece, just because I can, I'm going to invade you. Okay, a piece of necessity. We need to focus on retaking Europe. I don't care about Asia. Asia can be lost forever. Well, and just like that, the rest of the Balkans is now mine. This, this is, uh, this has to be done, I'm afraid. You're all that remains from me having total control of the Balkans, so, uh, yeah, I'm taking it. Thank you very much, Lee. Wow. Holy moly, that was very easy. Oh, perfect. We can now do our darkest hour. Wait a second. 
Since when was Japan at war with the Third International? Well, I don't mind pulling our men out of Asia. We get 250,000 manpower. Fair enough, it's not that amazing considering. Well, saying that, it's it gets us maybe about 14 divisions. Well, I don't know if I'm going to regret this decision to declare war on Spain, but we're doing it. Well, the southern invasion went very, very well. The one in the north is taking a little bit more to uh, win, but uh, for the most part, looks like we should be A-OK. -okay. Supply is taking a little bit of a beating, but I think as soon as Madrid gets taken, we should be much better off, hopefully. Well, Madrid has fallen. I was hoping it was going to help supply- oh! Well, it's not doing too bad now. There we go. Spain is ours, and most importantly, Gibraltar is now under my rightful control. So, well, actually, it's not really a rightful control, but um, access into the Med is completely secured by me. I have Gibraltar and the Suez, and I also control the Bosphorus, so I am I am dominating over here. It's just a shame I don't have Northern Africa from France, but hey-ho. Oh, oh. Okay, so Antonio has accepted our alliance proposal. While Canada has requested nothing in return, France has demanded to give them Alsace-Lorraine after the war, reversing the 1871 annexation. Shall we tr sign the treaty? Yes, I will happily sign the treaty. Okay, for some reason that hasn't worked and we are not in the faction with the Entente, but that's okay, we're going to work alongside them. That's all that really matters at the end of the day. Damn, the princely federations joined the co-prosperity sphere. I'm glad I did not declare war on them. Hello, France. Bet you weren't expecting to see me. Oh, no. Yes, let me sign all of these. We can all be friends in this new world that will be ushered in. Oh, my days. We've... Okay, I don't want to get too cocky too quickly, but we have successfully landed. Are we holding Russia? Um... I'm going to try and push to the, I don't know what river it is, the Dawn. It's part of the Dawn, I think. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll go with that. Let's try and get Brest. I wouldn't mind taking that. Oh no, Poland's been called in. Oh, what will I ever do? I honestly don't know. We have just completed two very, very nice national spirits. They're down here. Um, remembering the last war and furor, whatever that is. Um, but they give us nice wee attack bonuses against everybody, even Canada and the UK <laughs> and France. We're not going to need them. Uh, and plus 15 attack and defense on core territory. Well, I can't wait until we're fighting through Germany. Ha ha ha! Paris is well and truly mine. The commune of France is almost dead. Oh, I can't wait to slaughter the Russians that remain. Yes, take Lyon. Or even take Dijon and we'll, uh, we'll push in and hopefully cut them off up here. Oh my, oh, they're dead. They're dead. They're dead. Coming to France is dead. Oh, <laughs> look at all the Russians. Oh, you dicks. That's what you get. Um, Just just extend that. Then it's uh, time to um, just march all the way there. Oh, this is going so well. There's just pockets of divisions getting encircled as we go along because of uh, the capitulations of nations. Oh my days, we're, we're just romping our way. <laughs> we're just romping our way to Berlin. It's a terrible word to use, actually. But oh my freaking hell. Oh dear. Oh dear, Russia. Oh no. I feel like the entire Russian army is going to be dead before we even get to Russia at this rate. Oh, Maria's gone. It's now Vladimir. Carolyn. Who cares who you are? You're not going to be alive for much longer. Oh my days. Where the hell am I getting all that manpower from? See, special forces one would be nice if I actually had special forces. I think we go for this one to get the wee bonuses to organization, division recovery rate, attack, defense, and some stability. We're not doing so great on stability. Oh, that's hilarious. The cap all the commune of France is Oslo. Oh, that's tragic. Oh, we're about to hit the mother load if we can get an Mission accomplished. Thanks for joining us. All these trips down here. You are all dead as hell. <laughs> Look at them all. <laughs> oh. Oh, no. Don't do this to me. No. Don't f*** me like this. Oh. Uh, no. What? Why now? Why? The, the war's not over. It's not over. Well, that is a lovely encirclement. Can we please hurry up and kill them off?
because we are kind of still trying to push over here as well. Minus 20 war support for continuing on. I can't get peace with them. They can suck it so hard. Oh no, it's happened again. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to do some random ass crap for the time being. Yay, a Japan controlled German Union. That's dying as soon as we finish this war properly. Oh my days. Uh that's that is that's an encirclement of a hefty amount of Russian troops. How many divisions do you actually have left? You have a million manpower in your army. How how many do we have in here? Oh, uh, doesn't matter, they're all they're all dead. Uh great. Uh, nice, those the fronts have blinked up, so I guess there's no real reason to not go super thick and call Ukraine in. Ekater Ekaterinburg is the capital, of course. I cannot wait to have to march all the way up into the Ural Mountains to finish off Russia. That, 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 this just tells you all. That, that look at the percentages. I've done 62% of the fighting. I've lost 1.15 million in this war. I have put everything into this and you can bet your ass i'm taking the germany back off um, japan and every every part of russia's mine yes fair enough the french are over here there's not that many entente divisions oh well i suppose canada's taking romansk which is a positive congratulations you've done something of use oh they're so close to dying and then it's just been a case of taking on the union oh well done canada keep going i i'm helping sink some uh union britain ships their fleet is uh crap Look at the uh, number of friendly ships that are actually surrounding it. They are screwed. Well, Russia should die any second now. They're 99%. Um, they're just unable to completely stop. Yep, there they go. They're dead for the second time. Fantastic. Oh, a couple of wee... Wow, the Union of Britain really was not helping at all, were you? So, the Third International went from basically controlling all of that territory up here, um, and actually in here as well, to now literally just controlling... A couple of places. Oh, what we should probably do is liberate Portugal. Let's just get into those fools in the south. Well, I mean in Portugal rather, not in the south. What the actual hell am I looking at in there? What the hell is that? There is 82 divisions in there. Oh, what's our casualties right now? Do you you know, hold, hold the attack, I need this to die. So they've currently lost 1.61 million. Wow, that was only 400k, are you kidding me? Well, that was the entirety of their army, probably. They have 80 to 106, oh, there we go. We, we won. We legit won. Well, I have to say, the Ottoman Reich is looking fabulous. Ah, it's that time for this. Um, How long do I have to accept that? Can we hold off just for a little bit? Yeah, I, I didn't let Canada have Ireland. They, they weren't getting that much. Uh, yep, let's liberate everybody, 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 everybody. Central Asia, establish Central Asian Federation. I was actually going to give Transmur a little bit more land, but I thought, no, they don't deserve it. I deserve the majority. Well, indeed, all that remains to do... Oh, what? Oh, oh well. Uh, I guess we're going to become a puppet anyways. Um, yeah, it's it's now time for the liberation of the Reich. Few expected our defeat in the Second Weltkrieg and our subsequent banishment from Europe. Well, technically that's incorrect. You went to Turkey. Um, even fewer expected our return, thanks to Turkey. Uh, with the help of our auxiliary territories around the world, aka Turkey, uh, we must we have mustered the strength uh, to reclaim our homeland from the traitors and invaders that forced us out not too long ago. Massive celebrations have erupted throughout all of Germany, and the Geyser held a speech in front of the jubilous crowds of Brandenburg Gate. Uh, while damaged extensively, restoration has already begun to repair the monument. Yet, behind all the celebration and carousing, roundups of the supporters of the collaboration government have begun already, as we ensure we are never put in that position of exile again. Yes, Germany is free once again. Goodbye to all the generals that helped us there. We will rejoin Metal Europa, and yay, everybody that was our puppet is now Germany's, which is a load of crap. But hey ho, um, I done what I wanted to do. We, oh well, actually we managed to keep hold of Slovenia. Fantastic. Of oh, course that France has that, but uh, yeah, what actually happens to our tree now? Yeah, we just lose the exile bit. Cool. And I, th I think that's it. 
really. Um, obviously, we've not finished all the focuses. Uh, but, yeah, the world... So, Riggs Pack's a thing again? Ah. Are you able to create the Riggs Pack once more? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Of course. Germany could just backstab everybody. Um, please don't do that. Please don't do that indeed. And the more cursed thing is the fact that you don't actually have an army. That's hilarious. Anyways, guys, thank you very, very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this, well, I was going to say playthrough, this video, and also this series. I'll try and get a Texas video with Kaiser Wilhelm sometime in the future when it's a little bit more stable. And apologies once again for the delay in actually getting this episode out. But uh, such is the way... <clears throat> Anyways, guys... I am going to leave that episode there. It has been a hella fun one. That is a cracking way to finish off the series of uh, the adventures of Kaiser Wilhelm. Of course, I would have liked to have played as Texas. But I'll play as them once the Kaiser route's a bit, bit more stable. Or even if I get it to work, we'll see. Um, but yes, apologies for the delay in getting this Ottoman episode out. But uh, yeah, here it is. Hope you enjoy it. And uh, I'll be trying to get back to the usual schedule. Uh, sometime after this video goes out. I, I don't know when, but hopefully it'll be sometime soon. But anyways, guys, take care. Sure, bye. The now.